Tonight, we are giving you a sneak peek of the first Light the Night at Go Mark Ballpark. It's an interactive light show displaying more than 2 million lights and eight immersive themed displays. And that's where we find our Dante Ricky. Hi, Dante, how's the ballpark going tonight? Hi, Gina and Dave. Yes, we have moved right into the middle of it all here at Goldmark Park. This is a really spectacular brand new event that the city has put on after teaming up with the Charleston Dirty Birds, Goldmark and Salango Law Firm. This is now an amazing show of over two million Christmas lights that will be set up here for the next six weeks. Now, I'm right here near the North Pole Sports Spot, but the scenery, this particular position, it is absolutely beautiful. Just look off in the distance. Several lighted trees as well and decorations on this rather warm day. Even the Charleston Dirty Birds logo there off in the distance. But take a look at the Ferris wheel right here in the middle. There are 10 separate cars you can ride on this attraction and on top of that you'll get another great view of the spectacular light show below and the middle of this all is a large christmas tree 50 feet tall which in addition to being 50 feet tall has hundreds of lights these lights are going to animate and move based on the christmas music that is being played this is a great time for all the kids to go running around and some of them are coming through here as well and it's just really an amazing time this opens up tomorrow night might be a little soggy on your friday hey guys how you doing tonight you're on live tv good nice to see you. yes how you guys doing good how are you excited for the holiday season yeah looking forward to it it's going to be a lot of fun and hey tomorrow morning here on eyewitness news join us as you wake up at 5 a.m our entire news team will be live here at Goatmart park jennifer mcandrews anthony khan and meteorologist brandon stover and meteorologist brandon lawson will all be here waking up with you on eyewitness news this morning tomorrow friday at 5 a.m so make sure you join us then for the opening of light the night here in charleston which starts tomorrow and goes through new year's day january 1st so six weeks of fun Make sure you grab a ticket and find a good time to come on out here. I'm meteorologist Dante Ricky for Eyewitness News.